Friends, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and in today's video, I am going to show you how to add text in DaVinci Resolve 19. Before we jump in guys, would you mind taking a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button because this will let me know that you found value within this video. And on top of that, the biggest benefit is that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Now let's continue. So as you can see here, I'm inside DaVinci Resolve currently under the edit section here and I have a video that I've added to my timeline, right? So in order to add text to this video, you want to click on the effects on the upper left hand side. So once you click on effects, you will see that you have a bunch of options on the left hand side, right? So you want to ensure that you click on the toolbox to expand this section here and you will see the option that says titles so if you click on titles you will see quite a lot of text option that you can use so it starts off with the basic text right that you can choose basic text option and i'm going to add a few of them and show you what it looks like but there are quite a lot of other features here underneath the effects section but if you're looking for text you need to go to effects and then expand the toolbox and you will see the options that you have. So for basic text, right? For example, you can click on this and you can drag this to your timeline. Keep in mind that if you just click on it or double click, it will not do anything more than just show you in a preview what it looks like and that's about it. So if you want to add it to your timeline, click and drag it to the timeline and you can easily add the text. If you want to adjust the text timing, you can go ahead and go to one side of the text and just kind of make it smaller and you'll be able to do it. Now to edit the text, just simply ensure that you select the text that you have, click on it on your preview pane here or let's say your preview here and you can double click inside it and you can press even a control A to select it all and you can write whatever you want. So I'm going to simply type in hello here and I can make this larger. Now to make this larger or change the colors or whatever it is that you want to do for a text, that is very easy to do. All you have to do is just simply ensure that on the upper right hand side, you click on inspect. That's going to give you the options to modify things that is actually on your timeline. So for text, you can go ahead and you can change the text here. If you want, you can go into it and you can even change color here. I can change the color, click on OK. I can change the font as well. So if I would like to make something like this as an example, I can do so. You can go down as well and you can make additional changes to text. Now, have a look at Come this. Come back to Drew Tutorial. My text does not do anything there. So if you'd like to give it a little animation to this text, you can easily find that under the section that says settings. So you can come here and you can go under the section where you have, for example, dynamic zoom. You can switch this so you can ease in and out if you want. And you can also go ahead and make your text larger under the section for text. So as you can see, it is at 96. So I can make this larger if I want and have a look at the ease in and out that I just simply do to the text. Come back to Drew Tutorial. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to... That's a very basic text. Now, if you're looking for something much more interesting, much more animative, you want to go down under the Fusion text section. So you have quite a lot of options here that you can use. So what I'm going to do here, guys, I'm going to Simple choose one of those simple fusion text styles. So I'm going to choose, for example, the digital glitch. So let's choose this one and I'm going to simple drag this one to the timeline here. Right. I'm going to adjust it a bit as well. So let's make it a bit shorter. Right. And I'm going to change the sample of the text. So as you can see, it says sample text. I'm going to simple type, for example, due tutorial. So simple, something like that. I can also go ahead and find where they have additional text. So if there's additional text in the design, you can always change that. So I can select the next set of text and I'm going to simply type videos as an example here, right? It could be vice versa, but you get the idea. Now you can always change the font and color and make additional changes to the text. If you so desire, you can play around with the sizing as well if you want to make it larger and so forth, right? Now let's go to the section where it says settings and you can see what's there and some of these you will see that there are various type of settings there are various animations and so forth that you can play around with so you just need to go ahead and find the text that you like and check under the inspect control and also the settings to see what is there now let's see how this one looks so how to turn on or off activity on my comments that's it guys that's how to easily go ahead and add text 
in the DaVinci Resolve 9. Go ahead, be creative. I'm sure you'll be much more creative than myself, but it's very easy to do. And that's the basics of how to add text in DaVinci Resolve. Very easy and very simple. Here you have it, guys. I really hope you found value within this video. And if you do, don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.